Today, my guest is Sakur Erekat. He's the co-founder of Crypto Oasis Venture. Welcome, Sakur. Good to see you here. Thank you so much for having me. I'm uh, really proud to be here. Tell me what's happening. This is summer and the city is still busy. There is traffic <laughs> everywhere. Everybody is coming to UAE, not only UAE, now Saudi, Qatar. And what is the attraction point in this region? Well, I think um, the UAE has done something super significant, right? And they've built the right infrastructure, right? That attracts all of the talent and the capital. Right? So when we think about the infrastructure, we think about obviously all of the nice hotels, the roads and everything, but think about also the regulatory infrastructure and the digital infrastructure. With that, more and more talent is moving here and more and more capital is moving here. Right, right now we've seen announcements like the Virtual Asset Regulatory Authority, which was the first of its kind in the world. We've seen announcements of Ras al Khaimah announcing something like this. Abu Dhabi has been active since 2018. And most significantly now, there's the Dubai AI and Web3 campus all of these to attract smart people from all around the world. And to uh, publish this, you every regularly you are publishing a very nice report, Crypto Assets Ecosystem Report regularly. From this report, I know it's a very uh, long 230 report. pages. Yeah, yeah. but I, I looked at that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what are the highlights from, you, from the Web3 part, crypto part, blockchain part? We're, we're very proud of that report. It's an amalgamation of all of the hard work that is happening in the ecosystem. With that, in this report, we actually prove with numbers that we are the largest ecosystem for Web3 and blockchain in the world. We have more than 1,800 companies active in this space, and we have more than 8,600 people that are actively working in this space. With that, you know, multinational organizations from all around the world, but also local entities are setting up over here, and we firmly believe that the UAE is only going to accelerate this position. Okay. Also, Turkey is very active yes. in, in terms of like production, startups, cryptocurrencies. And recently, the relationship between Turkey and UAE and the region is getting much more better. So what can be the collaboration areas between Turkey and this region? I think the trade agreement between UAE and Turkey that was just announced is, is super significant. With that, we're looking to create 25,000 jobs between the UAE and Turkey by 2043 to invest to increase the oil non-oil trade to 40 billion. And today, it's up 40% already to 18.9 billion in 2022. With that, I think the, the, the Turkish ecosystem has something very important, which is the talented individuals that are working in this space, right? They have smart designers, they have smart coders. We're very proud to be supporting some of these entities from here in the UAE and investing in those entities as well. And I think Turkey has, is at this perfect position to be a, a, a trade partner, particularly with AI and Web3. Okay, good to hear that. So this is the message goes to Turkey because of Turkish, our Turkish audience. Last question is a bit futuristic because we are in a very futuristic place. There is vision <laughs> of the future in our behind. And right. uh, now this year AI take the all role. Uh, and I'm curious about what will be the next uh, AI. Or is it first it was metaverse, cryptocurrencies? And if you think about the future, can you give us some hints? Well, I learned the hard way not to predict the future. Having said that, I think there's a, the writing is on the wall. The UAE has announced this year as being the, the year of sustainability. COP28 is going to be launched over here and hosted over here. With that, I think the intersection between AI and blockchain and sustainability is going to be more and more important. The way we do things simply is not working and not sustainable. AI and blockchain provide trust transparency and traceability for this entire space and we've announced something called the green block to actually tap into that and are counting more than 300 companies that are working at the intersection of sustainability blockchain and AI okay. so I believe sustainability blockchain and AI is going to be the next trend